bugs must die. What is that about? Twelve dollar game. Eleven. This is more kind of my cup of tea as far as reviewing. Definitely my kind of game as well. It looks like. Shooting them with a machine gun, blasting them with missiles, dashing them with a vehicle, whipping them with an energy chain, or burning them all with a napalm. Uh, no matter how you get it done, alien bugs must die. This looks like fun. $12 is a pretty steep price for a game like this, but it does look like it's a well-made game. It is getting 90% positive reviews, and this game came out back on April the 5th, so almost a month ago now. Mm -hmm. Um... This looks like a lot of fun though, and it is a controller support. It does have controller support. If it says partial controller support, guys, the difference between full controller support and partial controller support, it doesn't mean probably what you think it means. A lot of people probably think this means, hey, only some of the controllers, some controllers will work with it. It doesn't mean that at all. What this means is, um, like, Full controller support would mean that you can use a controller to launch the game from your desktop and everything that you can do from a desktop computer can be done with a controller. That's what full controller support means. If it says partial controller support, it means that there may be some functions that you need to use your keyboard for, um, such as launching the game, for example. Um, full controller support is more like, hey, can you know a person that's maybe disabled or that can't have, doesn't have access to the keyboard or whatever, can they launch mm -hmm. the game and play it without any problem? So that's what that means. So we're gonna go ahead and drop this. We're gonna go ahead and jump into Bugs Must Die, a game given to me by the developers, and see if it's worth a damn. Uh, you're having a boring Sunday? Well, you came to the right spot, Diego. I mean, we're here to definitely entertain. Oh, we try our best. <laughs> All right. Music. Can you hear the music uh, on your other device yeah. here? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Full screen, camera height. We're going to go ahead and go in with a mouse and keyboard our first time, see how we do. All right, new game. We're killing bugs. Can't be too hard, right? Game called Bugs Must Die. Bugs Must Die. We're killing bugs. Planet M79 at the edge of the galaxy. I like the little intro here, though. A lone spaceship from the Galactic Pest Control Company. A <laughs> spaceship from the Galactic <laughs> Pest Control Company. A secret agency of the Earth Federation government flying towards the Earth. Um, headquarters. Agent M, two special agents, went missing on M79. We received these pictures from them before they lost touch. Your mission is to find the missing agents and see what the mantis beings want. Oh, I like it. Okay. Agent M. Yes, sir. Okay, so we must be Agent M. All right. Your ship is landing. You'll soon find what's waiting for you. Well, Uh-oh. I'm scared, Sarah. I know. It's okay. Primary training. You can do this. <laughs> All right. Commander, welcome to the primary training. We will learn how to move in this lesson. Okay. Um, move your vehicle by pushing the left stick on your controller or pressing WASD. Okay. Try to move the Jeep to the target. Gotcha. Okay. We... I think we got this. Alright. In lesson two, we'll learn how to aim your target and fire. Let me guess. Left mouse button and aim where I want. Yep. Not really tough, but I, li I like the fact they included a training. Yeah. All right. Well, I mean, you know, regardless of how tough it is, mm -hmm. it's still nice to have that training. It is. Yeah. Kind of warm up your fingers before you get going. Mm-hmm. 
QE to switch the weapons, okay. QE. Okay, we see the gun changing down here to Gatling gun or machine gun, okay. Ooh, I like it. This is cool. Now, aim at your target, then fire your sub-weapon by pressing right button on your mouse, okay. We Okay, we gotta get closer. We Yep. Oh Um oh, do it. Boom. There we go. Yay. Hmm. I like how it has it that you can drive over that. That's cute. Can't break the how wall. It's not. Oh yeah. Yeah. So fire. Um, destroy zero of five drums. Okay, how do I... Maybe I gotta shoot it over? There we go. There you are. Ooh, nice hit. You like that? Yeah. Alright. Ow. Yay! Hold left bon shift Diego or button B. I'm, I'm so sorry that it. Sunday is just not your day. Aw. No, I apologize. That's, that's awful. Well, hopefully your day will get better. Fingers crossed. Okay, so it's basically saying you can use your... Um, hmm. Okay, you can hold shift down and select which gun you want as well. Okay. Switch sub sub weapons. I thought I already did. Okay. Power ups. Oh, yay, power ups. We Ooh, you've Ooh, zero thirty mantises. mantises now. Ooh, I like it. Um, if you are in danger, press A on your controller or left control on your keyboard to call in air support. Ooh. Okay. Well, hell yeah, air support. Air support. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> Love it. I like the way they splatter too. Uh huh. Right. <laughs> There's a lot of uh, mantis scouts there. Mm -hmm. What's this? Oh no! Uh, when the upper left energy bar is shining, press left button uh, on your controller or Z on your keyboard to unleash your vehicle's special power. Is that a Z or is it supposed to be a two? I think it's Z. Uh, try both. <laughs> oh, it's the boss. Uh, oh, no! Oh. I got a special power. Oh, I thought I could run him over. Charge attack. It is Z. Yeah, charge attack. Maybe it is two. Nope, it's Z. Kill the boss. Okay. I think. Two? Nope, it's not two. Yeah, it's definitely Z. Oh, he got me. This is fun. All right. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Come on. Go. 
Oh, oh, oh! You can do it. <laughs> get him! I'm trying! Get him, get him, get him! He's so hard! <laughs> I wonder if I can shoot him down. I don't think it I don't think it wants me to shoot him down though. Oh, there it is. Okay. Got him. So I had to start firing and then hit Z. Mm -hmm. I thought it was a charge attack, like I could uh I had to charge at him. Alright, we know now. Alright. So now we got a tech tree. Oh, all kinds of upgradables, and this is cool. All right, we don't have enough money to upgrade nice. anything yet. Shop. Uh, we don't have anything to buy in the shop yeah, yet. Yeah, nothing yet. But the ability to upgrade and buy different stuff, and and uh, tech tree, and all that—that that is really cool. All right. Nice. I like this game. Doesn't that little guy with the shield look like he should be going? Mwah! Yeah, he does. <laughs> h and I've arrived at the location where agents last signaled. I hope you can find something. Good luck. Alright. There we go. Let's do this, Sarah. We're killing bugs. Now we're playing the game. No more training. This counts. Look at this. Oh man, I love this game. <laughs> I can tell. This is totally my kind of game, though. <laughs> this is a good one, though. Alright, destroy zero of 15 madnesses. What's this? Oh, we got like a little arcade game here. What is this? Oh, I got some money. Money, money coming out of an arcade machine. That makes sense, right? Sure. Break that down. Okay. Oh god, we got some manises here. You can do it. This game is so... This game just oozes quality, guys. You can feel it when you play it. Ooh, no lie. That? I don't know. Ooh, we've got something. This game looked pretty good on the trailer, but this game... Oh, no! This game is way better than it looks on the trailer, guys. This game just, like I said, it oozes quality. Oh, watch, 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 watch! I need some help. Remember, we can call an air support. <laughs> Boom, Sorry, look at that. I really get into games when I watch When she watches me play, yeah, she gets into I it. Do. I can only imagine if you were, like, behind me. You'd be shaking my chair <laughs> and screaming in my ear. And... Yep. Oh, All right. you for sure have your headphones on. <laughs> You're like, Sarah, stop. So I can use my mouse wheel to switch between satellite shield or grenades. And that's with my right mouse button. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Alright. So we can put on a shield here. There's my shield. That's cool. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh god. Oh no. No! I ah, know. There are towers. I'm really lucky there was an escape pod. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. So I was in a machine. Now I'm just running around by myself. Oh, no. Oh, no. How cool is that? Love it. <laughs> Sarah's really getting into this game, as you can see, guys. <laughs> I think Sarah can tell this is a good game. Oh, I can save these guys. Yeah, I saved them. Oh, God. Got it. Oh, I got my Jeep back. Oh. Full powerful health now. Yay. Can't shoot that. Okay. Kill the boss. We got a boss, there. Man, this game is so well done, though, guys. Like, this game, you would think when you look at it, $11.99. Um, $11.99. Oh, no! Oh, my God. $11.99 is a steal for this game, guys. 
Yeah, I don't think that's a lot of money for this game like I first thought because this game is fantastic. Oh god! I'm gonna give her a heart attack, guys. I like how he can hold up the shield and protect himself. That is so cool. Moving closer to him. Oh no! Watch out! You're not supposed to go flat close to the bed. Oh no! Oh my god. If you if this game sells fifty thousand copies, we will port it to the consoles. Look at that, guys. If they sell fifty thousand copies, they'll port it to the consoles. Alright. Oh my gosh. This game's gonna give you a heart attack, sir. I like this one, guys. What is this game called again? I already forgot. I don't remember. It's fun. Oh, super bug. It's called Sarah pulling at her hair, is what it's called. It's called Destroy All Bugs Must Die or something like that. Something All right. like that. <laughs> Love it. I'm gonna be playing this game quite a bit, I can tell you that right now. Alright, I need to get better at it, as Sarah can vouch. Uh -huh. Sarah's like, yeah, you definitely need to get better, you scrub. <laughs> Sarah's like, let me at it. Let me have let me at it play that game. <laughs> let me show you how it's done. Move over! Move over. I do this. <laughs> oh my god. I can imagine if you're screaming this much watching me play it, I can't even imagine watching you play it. I may have to ask the developer for a key to this game so we can watch you play it next stream. Oh my god. I'm sure the developer will more than be more than happy after hearing you to give me a key mm -hmm. so they can hear you scream and squeal to holler. Uh huh. Uh huh. The controls are so amazing, though, guys. They really are. I mean, you can tell when you play this game that it just oozes quality. I'm glad we looked at my key mailer data today. I know, I'm so glad. You usually do though. Mm -hmm. Damn it. Okay, I got it. Oh god. No! No, 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 no! Sarah, no, let me die, Sarah. <laughs> oh, I gotta go get these guys. Oh God. Yay. Okay. Got my Jeep back, Sarah. What? Yay. <laughs> okay, let's use some grenades this time on this on this round. We have 19 yes, of them. Yes, you need to. Oh, crap. <laughs> Damn it, no! There we go. Oh, I missed that one. Oh, God. Killed him. Oh, hi. How are you today? Glad you could come in. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Rock and roll, what's up, buddy? That's... Oh my god. He's ah! Good. He's good. Oh, oh He's god. Gonna give me a heart attack. I can't throw my grenades when I'm not making. That was pretty cool though, because you do this little wavy thing. Damn it! Damn it! Quit walking into the red. Ah. 
First thing first, upgrade your vehicle's hit points. Makes sense. Let's do that. So now we get some points. So I like these kind of games that do this. So even if you got, you know, you go in and you play and you die a couple of times or whatever, you kind of feel like, oh, you just lost everything. No, you're still earning points that you can put into, you know, upgrading your, your, uh, your thing. So health points. Um, we do have. Where does it say how many points we have to use? Health points three of three. Um, oh, I can change here. Power range, speed, power range, speed. Choose hero. No, let's stick with what we had. Shop. Hmm. Buy. Oh, we can buy one gold with 500 copper coins, okay. Um, I am doing very good today. Thank you for asking. Upgrades, here we go. Okay, so we can add one hit point, but we need 80 silver. We don't have nearly that yet, or 300 pennies or coppers or whatever they are. So we don't have enough to upgrade our hit points yet. Okay. So we're going to have to play more, but every time we play, we're going to get more points. So you sure you want to go back to main menu? Fine. All right. I like this game. I like this game a lot. Skip. No. No, we're not doing training. Escape. Can I escape? No, I don't want to. I don't want to do training, man. Um. No. Back to base. Yeah, no training. You already did your training. Oops. Wait a minute. Primary uh. training again. Okay, I think I see what I need to do. Escape. 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 Thank you. Back to base. We need to go over here, I think. The quest is not active. Damn it, man. Okay, well, I guess we can't skip the training. Hmm. That's weird. I wonder why. Is yeah, it it's because weird. it's a new level? I don't know. Yeah, it's gonna. There's probably a way to do it. Let's see. You know what? Let's uh. Back to base. Um, go back here. Yes, main menu. Load game, maybe. Mm. Tier 18, maybe? Primary training. The... Well, hmm. That's interesting. What's under the option? Uh. Oh, mm, 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 mm. I mean, it's not that big of a deal to do the training again, but you would think it wouldn't make you do this again. Under options here, what you said, sir. Well, I was just saying, maybe something under option that had as far as training is concerned. Yeah, like skip training or something. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Yeah. No. Controls. Hmm. That quits the whole game. Hmm. Okay, so now we come in here. Now we haven't got... Oh, yeah, we still got our coins. Okay. So here we go. Stage zero. That's where we were. Huh. There we go. Well, we figured it out. Yay! Escape! I don't want to read all that. <laughs> yeah, to the developers, I would definitely make this yeah. easily, more easily skippable. Because people aren't going to want to read this a hundred times. I know I had to do kind of the same thing with my Rocket Roll game. Um, Alright. They want to get back into the fun, man. And this game is definitely fun.
Yeah, I remember when I looked at the price of this game, I was like, $11.99 seems like a little bit much, but... No, this game is... Once you play it, you'll be like, yeah, this game is a great price of $11.99. Here's where Sarah starts screaming. Oh. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting better. Mm -hmm. Until I die. I don't know how much fun a game like this is to watch. But... Well, I don't know about other people, but... <laughs> I'm having a time with this. Huh. I like the music. The music is really good. Can you hear it on your other device, sir? Mm -hmm. oh. Oh, the red. oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Easy. <laughs> oh god. I think people are just watching for my reaction. I think so. Oh my crying. god, well, there's power up. Oh no! Oh no! Right after I got the power oh, up too! Oh, escape pod! Second chance, basically. Mm -hmm. Right after I got that power up too. Boss, I think. Oh, 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 oh. oh well, I was way too far. Oh no! Get out of the way! Oh god! He's getting faster! Mm -hmm. Oh! Don't. We're putting my hands over my mouth, isn't working. <laughs> Devil. Mm -hmm. oh, oh. Oh, oh. oh no! Oh God, no! No no no! Be careful! <laughs> yeah, baby, <gasps> we did it. Yeah. Car looks like the '89 Batmobile. I found nothing oh. here. Definitely better to let you get that money because yeah, it's better that work. You need that money. I know, so I can buy an upgrade, huh? <laughs> oh yeah. Whoa! What is going on? Oh, there you go. I thought it was lagging, but it was loading or something. All right. So now we got a shotgun and a rocket. That's cool. Sub weapon, super dark. Man, I love this. All right. So we got a new machine gun shop. Um. <laughs> oh, we can spend money to upgrade our Gatling gun or our shotgun. Where was the? Uh... Right here? Well, no, where did we see the upgrade to the... My Jeep or whatever? No, that wasn't it. Um, I don't know. I thought we saw it under shop. I don't remember. I didn't pay attention. Mm-mm. Not there. Mm-mm. I thought it was here somewhere. Hmm. Well, let's, uh, 
Let's upgrade our Gatling gun, whatever. Sure. Okay. Good job, Zach. Thanks, rock and roll. How you doing today, man? I think Sarah already asked you. Welcome, yeah, we will learn from how to use the three different melee weapons in the advanced training. Okay? Yeah, he said he's good. Yay. Okay. What so you been up training. to? Gear Storm. There will be Mantis soldiers around you. Destroy them with this melee weapon by pressing left trigger on your controller or space on your keyboard. Okay. Let's do it! What? Okay. Let's try again. What? Wait a minute. Hang on. Oh, there we go. I was getting killed before I could use it. Oh, see, there's a timer down here on it. You can't use it like... There's a cooldown. Ah. There we go. A metal dash, a laser line will chase you. Reach the door of the next room before you are killed. Okay. And how do you use the metal dash? Mm -hmm. Space again. Okay. Oh, okay. Rock and Roll says that he has been up to Uh oh, Rock and Roll. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, what are you doing? <laughs> Please look at following the demonstration program. Once you use the Zeus shield, your vehicle is temporarily unable to move. During this period, your vehicle will flash in blue and then in red. When you, you can't move. When your vehicle is blue, and hit by a projectile, it is invincible. Okay. But if you're red, you're gonna die or take damage. When your vehicle flashes red, it means the effect of the zoo shield has expired. So let's try successfully using the zoo shield three times. Oh, okay. To block the attacks. Okay. That's cool. Man, I'm loving this game. <clears throat> loving, loving, loving this game. Fantastic game. And it has like 10 reviews on Steam or whatever. Definitely much more deserving of more reviews and more exposure than what it's getting. Like I say, to fully appreciate this game, Rather than seeing it on my screen, guys, you guys need to play it. Because once you get your hands on it, once you play it, you'll feel how awesome and how much quality there is in this game. I mean, I can't even begin to tell you how how enjoyable it is to play. Because the, the controls are that fluid and flawless. It's just a very high-quality Cody game. I mean, it's perfect. Give me that coin. Mantises, leave me alone, you freaky bugs. Gonna, this is definitely going to make it any gold. No doubt oh, yeah. about it. Definitely. Even at a $12 price tag. Oh, that's great. When did this game come out? I think it came out like a, a month ago or something, didn't it? I don't remember. I think it was, uh, was this the April 15th? Stuff like 
That I don't pay attention to. Oh, I got I got I got a, I got a uh, <laughs> hit points plus one. Nice. Alright. Yeah! Come on, biatches, watch this. Watch this, are you ready? Watch this, are you ready? I'm very, I'm very Look at that! Look at that! Woo! Gotta outsmart him, Sarah. Aha! Got it. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh shit! <laughs> this one I thought I was a badass. They got you. I got I got I got sneak attack. Little yeah. bastards. I thought I was all cool and shit. Go up there and get smacked. Hey, Damn it. Thinking you're cool. Hey, be nice. I just <laughs> saved these guys. This game is so much fun, guys. It really is. You know I'm here to annoy you and tease you. <laughs> I love it. Alright. Choose reward. A power-up? Can silver? Or an ice driver? Oh. Hmm. Does it tell you... I don't know what these are. It doesn't give you any information. Um, let's see what ice driver. That sounds interesting. What's that? I don't know. Okay, I want to change my weapon out. Oh, that's that. Okay, wait a minute. Um, oh, that's the plane. I didn't mean to do that. There we go. That's what I, that's what I wanted to do. Gatling gun. That's what we should. There we go. Yeah. Oh, there's my. That's what I bought right there. I think. Yeah, because I bought an upgrade to this Scatling gun and I wasn't even using it. Mm -hmm. Silver! God, this game is so fucking good. I wish you guys could feel how good the controls are on it. Like, most games like this don't even have half as good of controls or feel this good to play, guys. I'm not even joking. That's where this game excels, is in how responsive mm -hmm. and how awesome it feels to play. Which makes a big difference, it really does. See, it makes a huge difference. Mm -hmm. It makes a huge difference when you can, when you know you're not fighting controls or um, right. when everything just, just flawless execution based on your movement. Yeah. And for a game like this, you need really good controls, you know? Yeah, you do. To be able to move out of the way quickly. Oh, we have six in this tree. There's right not now. many games Welcome like this. Everybody. Like, I've played Binding of Isaac, guys, and Binding of Isaac is really well loved. And it's a game sort of like this, you know, in a way. Um, except this uh, obviously has bigger areas, less rooms, but bigger areas to, to, you know, combine in or whatever. And I'm telling you, I've played Binding of Isaac. This game controls, like, twice as good as Binding of Isaac. That's how good it is. And you guys know how popular Binding of Isaac is. Oh, there we go. Now, what does that do, though? All right. Gun ammo plus 100. Yay! Oops. Machine gun ammo plus 100, plus 100. Oh god! I feel like I'm kicking ass now. And when a game can make you feel like a badass just from playing it and having this much fun, I mean, it's awesome too. feel like a badass when you play this game. Mm -hmm. Hi. Bye. <laughs> what is that little thing chasing you? Kill the boss. That's something I bought. Or I said choose your reward. I don't know exactly what oh. it is. But... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's shoot. Is it shooting? Oh, no, you have different lasers. Does he, does he, like, upgrade your ammo or something? Maybe. You know, oh. that's something. I say something. Kill the boss. We have a boss to kill. Oh, no. Okay, I took off my shield <laughs> so I can use the grenades. 
I don't know if it was a good choice or not. Okay, where's this boss at? Because these are just little minions. I think I'm getting better at the game. What do you think, sir? Alright. Is it in here? Aha. Oh, no. The invader's gonna die. Uh-oh. No. <laughs> oh, these track you down. Oh, my God. What the fuck, man? Don't. No, no. Holy crap. Oh, God. That was a direct hit, though. He's a cheater! I got him. Wait a minute, no clues, sir. Uh, this base has underground parts. Investigate it now. Woohoo! Woohoo! He's proud of me. I'm so proud of you. Hell yeah. Alright, Loot City. All right, go investigate. You never liked Binding of Isaac? Yeah, a lot of people love it. Um, now we got a heat-seeking weapon. We got a, bro a broiling saw as a sub-weapon. And our, oh, just a drone. The Ice Driver is a drone. Okay, I wish I gave you more information about what it does. It probably does somewhere. All right. Hmm. New. The drone slot is locked. Okay. Machine gun, Gatling gun. Tech tree. Rocket launcher. Heat seeking. We got all kinds of cool stuff. Alright. Um. We have 800 copper and 96 silver. Um. Damage plus 10%. Weapon plus one. Heat seeking. Upgrade. Yeah. We're buying it. Damage plus 10%. Done. Alright, go. Let's just do it. Okay, I need to change my, um... Gatling gun, let's change back to the Gatling gun. And then... I like how we block, so it's cool. Bye-bye. Guys trying to spawn behind me and shit, sir. Mm. You little manises. Oh god. No. I only have 17 seconds. Oh, one up in. 17 seconds until I get my team back. I got gotcha. you. Oops. Damn it. <clears throat> Guys, this game is fun. I'm going to quit playing this game, but spin coins, no, we'll wait. 
This game mm -hmm. is so good, guys. So fucking good. <laughs> I could sit here and play this game for hours, I feel like. Bugs must die. Amazing. Absolutely love it. Um, let's take a look at that um, game store. I want to see when it launched and all that. Yeah, April 5th. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, April 5th. So it launched um, more than three weeks ago. Only has 11 reviews. You can see why 90% of those are positive reviews. Like, I, I'm doubting, like... 90%? 90%. I wonder what's the other 10%. Yeah, like, what, it's I mean, probably what 1 to the 10. 1 to the 10. Actually, 43 what positive is, reviews. With all the key reviews and stuff like that. Review it? 43 positives, 1 negative. What okay. on earth? And... Is there a translator? I can go to Google and get it. Let's see what this well, yeah, Chinese because we game. know how well that works. Uh -huh. It'll work uh -huh. good. It'll get a, It'll work good enough to where we get a good idea. Of what uh, they're an idea, to say. yeah. <laughs> Translate. Let's see what this guy has to say. Isn't an online game? Is the upgrade system to library play for yourself a refund? Because it's not an online game, this guy's an idiot. It says single player right here. Nothing in here makes it sound like this game's an online game. I knew before I even looked at it that it wasn't an online game. Like whoever negatively reviewed it because it's not an online game is a fuck. You're a fucking idiot, dude. Really? Yeah. That is what they had to say. They give it a negative <laughs> review. They give it a negative That's review because it's stupid. not an online game. Duh. Um. Fantastic fucking game though. The uh, the. The replayability with oh all the gosh. upgrades and all the different stuff you could buy, uh, different level design, um, all the different bosses. This is just an amazing game, guys. There's no doubt about it. I'm, and I'm betting that some of these reviews here um, have many more hours than the game costs in dollars. So it does cost um, $11.99, so 12 bucks in American currency. Three and a half hours, six... You know, the game just came out and it already has people with you know, six, seven hours, there's one hour there, 1.8 hours, 3.1, 3.8. I bet mm. you, I bet you somebody has more hours than it costs in dollars already. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. I bet you. It's just that good of a game. Four and a half. Um, I don't, anyway, I'm gonna. <laughs> Was the reviewer slow in the head? <laughs> he asked. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't begin to understand that, dude, like. <clears throat> Mm -mm. For some reason, it's not showing all the reviews, but I love it. I especially That's when you great. play the when you play the game, you feel how how well it controls and everything like that. Like I bet uh -huh. you I could get my son over here, and I bet you look at this, like forests. Look at this. There's different forests. There's deserts. Mm -hmm. There's buildings and lasers. Look at that. Just. Not everybody likes these kind of games, but I'm saying there's a hell of a lot of people that do. And, uh, this is one of the rare games that just controls so well that it's a beautifully done yeah. game. DG Games Workshop, I wonder if they have any other games. This is the first game on Steam. Try the demo, guys. Yeah, I mean, if you have any doubts, try the demo. Um, because 12 bucks That's is a lot of money, you know, to, you know, to spend on a game like this. But for this guy, for this developer's first game on Steam, I am super impressed. Um, I really am. If I had to grade the value, guys, easy 40 out of 40 at $12, $12 because I can guarantee you, uh, if you like this kind of a game over the next, you know, six months to a year, you're going to get well more than 12 hours out of the game. And uh, just how much fun it is to play as well also adds to the value. Uh, it just controls so well and everything like that. Uh, 40 out of 40, easy there. Uh, next criteria is how much fun is the game out of 30 points. Guys, again, this is going to be the subjective part of my scoring. You know, uh, what I grade as a high score here may not be exactly your type of game, but if you enjoy these kind of, you know, bullet hill type games, uh, twin stick shooters, you're going to love the shot of this game. 30 out of 30. Um, no doubt about it. Controls and bugs. Again, I can't say it enough. Uh, this game probably deserves more than 20 points out of the 20 for 20 for controls and bugs because it controls that well. It's just a joy to play and control. Um, but 20 out of 20. And graphics and sound for the type of game that it is, guys. The music is really well done. The graphics are really well done. Mm -hmm. 10 out of 10. So not, not, not only that, guys. I mean, the game is just 
uh, you, you add that all up. I didn't take a point away anywhere, did I, Sarah? A perfect 100 score. I think that's the second game yeah. I've ever reviewed that got a perfect 100 score. Wow. $12. Bugs Must Die. That's you like this kind of game? Go get it, guys. It's it's phenomenal. It blew me away. I didn't think I, I thought it would be good. I mean, if I really thought it was going to be as good as I it was, I've had the key setting in my my Keymailer account for weeks, and if I would have known it was going to be that good, I would have already played it. But I didn't think it was going to be nearly as good. You don't really know how good this game is until you play it, until you feel it, and then you appreciate the beauty that is the game. Mm -hmm. So who would expect a game called Bugs Must Die that comes out of nowhere with 11 reviews to be this good? This game deserves all the success in the world. If there's a game on Steam that should have 500,000 reviews a year from now, this would be the one. This game and this developer deserves all the success in the world for what he's done with this game. It's a beautiful game. Can't say enough about it. Um, people are probably listening to me rave about this game and they're probably thinking, wow, this developer paid Zaxter99 <laughs> to say this. No, no, I, no. I would, I would no, never accept such a... No one would... I would he never accept some kind of a bribe. For reviews. I yeah. would never accept a, some kind of a bribe. Um, kind of reminds mm -hmm. me of an old school arcade game like Commander. Yeah. Um, yeah, it does. Command, you're, you're, I know which one you're talking about. The uh, Commando, I think. Is that what it was called? This game. Mm -hmm. And like Rock and Roll said, I'm sure this is one he's talking about. Yeah, I mean, except this game just takes advantage of the technology today and just does everything this game couldn't do. You got better graphics, smoother gameplay, but this game was a, a joy to play and you didn't really know how much fun this game was until you get your hands on it and started playing it. Um, Bugs Must Die is like this game times 10. So if you remember enjoying a game like this back in the arcades, back in the 80s or 90s or whenever this came out, you, you absolutely must buy Bugs Must Die because this is Commando times 10. Um, absolutely beautiful what looks like a flawless game. I haven't obviously played it all the way to the end, but I'm sure this game has many, many hours uh, to before you actually get to the end game and beat it. And then you're going to have all the replayability of going in and doing the different, you know, playing the different, uh, uh, you know. Yeah. Commando was released in 1985. 1985, yep. Uh-huh. Great game. Yeah. Bugs Must Die, guys. Probably going to wind up, I'm sure this is going to end up being my game of the year for 2015. So... Uh, I just, I don't see another game getting a 100% score, but who knows? I remember last year, I didn't think any game would get a 100 score. Actually, I think two games got right out, right at or near 100% at the end of the game last year, and those were my first two games. So this is either my second or third 100% score. And that shows you, you know, that even though there's more and more trash coming onto Steam every day, guys, uh, and so many developers upload either asset flips or garbage onto Steam, there are hidden gems and indie gems that uh, you know need to be uh, discovered but uh, this is exactly why I do what I do on my channel it's not to actually find all the trash my objective when I play all this trash and when I review these indie games that hardly anybody's heard of it's to find games that just like Bugs Must Die a beautiful exactly. game yeah. yeah try to shine them out from under the flat under the uh, limelight uh, under all the garbage and uh, get them some more reviews get them some more sales um, that's not very many reviews for a game of this quality that's been out for a month. I mean, I feel like this game should be <coughs> over a thousand reviews right now. It deserves much more success. Absolutely. Well, hopefully through today. Hopefully it'll know, help. Whoever is, is listening and watching. Look at all that. I mean, go out and try it and then and, say... Yeah, try the demo. Yeah, and then tell their friends, be like, hey, I found this great game. And that's just how the word will spread. Exactly. It, it looks like a great game. Yeah, I mean, you can come right to the Steam page here, right, guys? And you can download the demo for free. Try it yourself. I encourage you to do it. Try it yourself. See what you think. See if you agree with me that it feels fantastic when you play it. And then make up your mind on it if you want to spend the 12 bucks on it. But you can go <laughs> you can, you can, can go way wronger. You can go way worse than this game, especially when you're spending, you know, $30, $40, $50 on some of these AAA games that just aren't nearly as much fun. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. 